million dollars worth of drugs. My brother here says, what does the police, what does law enforcement do with all those drugs, all that money that they, they apprehended? What do they do with it? It's so funny you say that, brother, because I've really thought about this a lot. I walk the straight and narrow in life. I am a complete law-abiding citizen. I am a nerd, hence me having these two flags in the background, right? But like a lot of us who are from California, I have family that was ripped for shit, that was involved in certain activities, just like most of y'all do. It ain't no secret. We all did. And just like you, you know, I got them family members or people that I knew who had six, seven cars, Bentleys, was rich, had that real dope money. It was nice, all that other shit. And usually there's a fall, whether it's the police get them. Sometimes the police get them. Sometimes they shoot somebody. And when the police apprehend their ashes, everything that happened to be at the house, you know, they take. And I always wonder, you asking that question about drugs, but I wonder this just in general. What did they do with all them candy cup, candy painted cars, all that shit? What did they do with all the shit that they took from drug dealers when they arrested them or when they um, raided homes, et cetera, et cetera, like in California? Like, what did they do with all that shit? I've always wondered that. I... I think about that a lot sometimes. Like, there, there's one dude, I ain't saying no names because I don't want to invite that type of energy, but he was literally one of the, like, the richest dope dealers in, in Sacramento. And I always wondered, like, when the feds got him, what did they do with all that money, all that shit that they took? From? Like, what did they do with all of that? Like, what did they... Mm. It's interesting. It's interesting. 